tales of love and lost ship and stuff. And Marvel, let's face it, that's why we're all here. Some of us, most of us, all of us. Chapter 7 is upon us. There we go. I've already taken the liberty of clearing out uh, mission one, but I will replay it just to get its challenge mode out of the way. Also, so you guys can see it as well, for those of you who aren't there. I don't know. But let's do this. Agent, the Circle of Eight has drawn the Hellfire Club's attention again. Black Knight confirms that Selene is here in San Francisco. Dan, I tracked her here. From what I have gathered, she's looking to tap the energies of the Circle of Eight's ritual sacrifices. But why? I do not know yet. Last time she tried something like this, she was after the Philosopher's Stone. But luckily, the Full Metal Alchemist stopped her. Well, that's not in San Francisco. It's more likely she's seen what's happening with the Worthy. She thinks she can piggyback on the serpent's power. When we find her, we'll know. Let's get moving. And keep an eye out for magic. She's searching the city for sentinels left over from Bastion's attack. Complete back, Black Queen, Black Knight. On challenge mode. Oh, hey, they killed my uh, group boss. Sweet. And more lockboxes I can use for something. I don't know. We get a hero out to sweep the Circle of Eight Ritual Massacre Theaters. Now that we suspect those are related to the Weather Hammers, we need to get after them more actively. Agent Venom. <laughs> I survived. Nice. It was me. Are you on a gold match? No, I'm on oh, okay. Nice. Make sure everything is still working properly. Make sure this is... Okay, it's recording. And it's good. Everything should be working. To my dashboard. Okay, now. Says I'm online. Alright. I guess everything is working properly, then. Okay. Well, that all said and done, let's go kick the shit out of some Circle of Eight people. Because why not? Uh, knocking bird, I don't use you. Let's use you. I guess. She used to be good, and then five other characters came forth that had her same ability. Or basically her same ability. This guy. And cut this bitch, I don't know why. <laughs> it was me. I saw the cookies from the cookie jar. Sorry. 
No, they tried to kick you out. I did it. I know, right? I'm so looking forward to seeing Craven the Hunter. Actually, one of my one of my major things in this chapter is I'm super looking forward to fighting both Mysterio and Absorbing Man. Just because they're new. Alright, let's see. <laughs> A detachment of San Francisco police appears to have fallen under Celine's sway. We need them controlled, but we can't just take them out permanently. Send Gamora to take decisive action. Because when I think subtle movements, I think an assassin. <laughs> Craven versus Kazar and Shauna. Oh yeah, totally. Celine looks to have put her magical touch on some of San Francisco's finest. Gamora, we know non-lethal responses aren't your strong suit, but would you mind taking these guys down without leaving too many marks? After all, they're being mind controlled. Why me? You were closest. Ah, uh, shield proving why it makes the best decisions. <laughs> Only in some cases. 50 dollar gold sale? What are they offering? Let's take a look. Oh. That's what they're offering. That's pretty swanky, I'm not gonna lie. Ooh. That's pretty awesome. A suit with two empowered ISO-8 slots. That's pretty crazy. You could... God damn it. Oh, hold on a second, let me pull down the chat for a half a second. Fix my screen. This is what you people make me do when I have to look at gold sales. God! Oh. Don't you think of the children? Coral! Anyways. God, I don't know. I think $50 may be a steep price to pay for that. But God, that looks pretty cool. I mean, if you've just got way too much money to spend on this game, go for it. Otherwise, it's PvP fodder. Basically, is what it is. Sup, Cyber Mage? Uh, nothing much. I'm currently in Mission 1 of Chapter 7. Redoing it mainly just for the stream because I already finished up all the tasks needed with it and I should be moving on to two. But I figured I'd do the uh, challenge mode while I was here. Knock that out of the way. Ugh. Someone with a different colored name. Now not everyone is pink. Famine or Pestilence Beast. Those are two hard choices. Which character do you use more often than not? Rogue or Beast? I'm not talking to you. We know you do. But that's not the question. Just go back to Mass Effect. Ah, both. That's... That makes it difficult then. Um... Depends on what you want. Famine can constantly keep removing buffs off of characters each round thanks to her ability, and I don't think you can get rid of- or no, I think you can block that. On the other hand, everyone knows what Beast can do, so... I don't know, I don't really like Pestilence for the sheer fact he blocks my own combos. I can't keep debuffs off myself with him on my team. So personally, I would go Famine. But if you play PvP, and let's face it, most everyone does except for me, apparently. Go Pestilence. You don't play, period. You don't play Marvel. <laughs> you're arguing about a discussion that you're not even a part of. It's like going into theoretical yeah, theoretical science and going, you're wrong because I jumped on the bed. <laughs> I'm 
you're wrong because I ate a peanut butter sandwich this morning. That doesn't have to do with anything. I win. I, it, just a theoretical person in this argument. Not me specifically. But yeah, that's, that's a really hard choice. It just all depends on what strategy you're trying to form. Yes, I'm gonna... This is Chapter 7. I'm playing it right now. This is Mission 1 of Chapter 7. <laughs> I'm already in Chapter 7. Oh, I gotta hit this guy because he's got protect on him. There we go. Out of time. <laughs> time displacement. Bang, 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 bang. That was wrong. Okay, no, it's all good. Yeah, I, I basically said today I'm only doing Chapter 7 of Marvel. And I'll do my normal stuff tomorrow for the regularly scheduled stream. I was just doing this so I didn't have to compete with both Marvel and Borderlands at the same time. <laughs> also because people for some reason like watching me get the outfit. Despite the fact that I could earn it in three days time myself. Yes, T-Peg, you always miss the stripper cake. You're not old enough for stripper cake. Sorry. Engage him now or continue to hunt for Celine. Agent, that one's yours. Call. Damn, I skipped through all that dialogue. It was basically announcing Bullseye. He's here. Working with Celine. Nothing else. But, heroic mission. Why does everyone like Borderlands? It's a new game... <laughs> Anyways, I don't know. I like Borderlands. I'm not hardcore up for it, but... Anyways, Bastion emerges to spread his intolerance in San Francisco. A dose of magic and technology should clear that right up. Omega and, uh, magic. Why, what the hell is Birch, and why do you hate Gearbox? Shield. I didn't just find Sentinels, I found Bastion, or should I say he found me? Shadow of Mordor looks like a cheap Assassin's Creed knockoff to me. Also, I don't like Lord of the Rings. So, I doubt I'll find little enjoyment in it. So, that's automatically why I don't want to play it. <laughs> We've got assets in there. Magic, uh, magic. Karma? I don't know. Damn Indians and their hard to pronounce names. No offense to anyone that's Indian in the chat. <laughs> I'm not Indian, shut up. I'm not racist. I hate everyone equally. Closing on the target location. Perfect, I can eliminate a mutant and a turd code at the same time. Better than I had expected. So they couldn't think of their own combat, so they stole it from Batman. That doesn't make it any better. That was almost like a, The Amazing Spider-Man 2. Which I also got bored of. She's the writer of Borderlands. Okay, before we drop the EA bomb on anyone... <laughs> I don't think any company will ever be bad as EA. Yes. I don't know. To each their own, I suppose. Let's see if you still feel that way once you've gotten a taste of limbo. You see that? Magic's pissed at you. She's gonna fuck you up. Or I was gonna say, or it's not gonna get, or it's not gonna load. <laughs> I 
You under underestimating a character, perhaps one of the most fatal things one can perform. I don't know. I like uh I like uh Null as a defender. He'll be amazing. I luckily unlocked all the Spec Ops heroes. I've never had to buy one except for Mockingbird. And that's because fuck that Spec Ops. <laughs> Helios Protocol. And Hologram Array. I'll neutralize her. And wind her. He'll be enraged. Stepping Disc. I know, right? I'm so looking forward to fighting Mysterio. And Omega Sentinel's kind of good. A little bit tricky to use until she's fully leveled up so she can use all of her skills, but ultimately fun. I'm a fire in my laser. I'm gonna at least make I'm gonna at least make it past mission three. It'll take more than a little brimstone to deter me, Ileana Rasputin. As it happens, I'm more than a little brimstone. And yet I am <laughs> undeterred. I must revise my expectations of myself upward. Oh no, a magic warding shield! Oh no! It's because they're they're coming soon. They're releasing them separately. They're gonna have a big sale of them, basically. Uh, let's see. Defense array. So I can at least tank a little bit. Last right through his shield. Your faltering fists are no match for my fists. So let's see, magic warding takes reduced damage from magic, immune to harmful magic attacks, she absorbs damage. Magic is very fun. She's very useful, especially since her retool. Uh, she can apply several deadly debuffs, and then I believe she exploits adoration and something else with her moves. She's a lot easier to use once her retooling, now that she has a chance to... that her stepping disc ability does not take a soul charge to use. Damn, almost killed him. What does Soothing and Power do? I don't remember. <laughs> Doubtful. They say they're testing Spec Ops 22 right now, but I expect we'll probably see a Spec Ops next month, probably. Oh, is that that one where you can get extra health for, uh, Recharging. Uh, let's see. Chance to gain the positive aspects of the target's class when attacked. 
Summoned eyebites now apply breakdown. Really want this one. Curses one away. <laughs> 